right. Well, Crook. We have a lot to do today. Well, what's left of the day anyway? And of course the fog would roll in just now. Right as I'm about to try to cross this river. With luck that bear will leave me alone, but... First thing that we need... So says Madanak. Oh, I should be careful. Rock falls and wolves, apparently. Right, Crook. First thing that I need, or that we need, rather, are allies and supplies. Especially weapons and armor. And I can think of no better ally than our fellow pariah. We are, after all, all children of the Reach out here. Now, of course, the question is whether or not they'll actually let me in to speak with one of them. This is rather an imposing structure. Ah, ah. You tell them, Crook. Arguing with the eagles again, I see. Do they not have any guards? I heard a goat. That is not unusual for these parts, though. Gates are open. I am sure they shouldn't be. Excuse me? Malakath blesses this land for the orcs, and the orcs alone. Huh. <laughs> Interesting. Although I am trespassing on your land specifically, so... Understood. Is there a way for me to... Convince you to let me speak to your... Ard. Your... whatever you call your leader here. Hmm. We've heard whispers of an enchanted pair of gauntlets, hidden and protected by dangerous men. Beasts, or worse. They are called the Forge Master's Fingers. Bring them to our chief, and he will decide if you're worthy to be bloodkin to the orcs. Your chief? Of course. 
I'll find those gunboats for you then. We will see. The question, of course, is where? Oh. Thank you. Interesting. And where is that? Is that in Brooker's Leap or is it... It must be. Well, thank you for that assistance. Hopefully this won't take too long. They are impressively accurate. Good allies to have. Now then. Just down this way I see. I hope that's how I get there from here. Deep wood for doubt. It's a bit outside of my abilities right at the moment, I think. I should probably also at some point go home. <laughs> it's just around the corner here, more or less. Right. Crook? Ah! Go ahead and take off, will you? Where we're going, a uh, crow might be a bit of a hassle. Something tells me that the Brooker's Leap clan will not exactly be Pleased to see me. Or any other intruder for that matter. Gods! Yo, bear! Rookie mistake. Do not sneak up on bears. <laughs> Foxes are all right. That beautiful spring weather in the reach. Where 
have I gone? Exactly where I want to go. All right. Figured as much. Is a bit difficult to navigate in the fog. I will probably be able to hear the redoubt before I see it. What should that be? Who knows? Some sort of dwarven ruin, probably. There we are. And now our hunt begins. Well, it's not exactly a popular spot, is it? See him. Oh. Her. Apparently. I'll have to tell Madanak to come. Deal with this place later. You're going to need to be fed in the meantime, aren't you? There must be good layers. I'll be back for you. Glory to the Forsworn. Here's somebody is being prepared for burial or to become a briar heart. I'm not sure which. Huh? Ah, that is a briar heart. Oh! 
Wrong spell. It's fine. This is close quarters. All right then. Damn you! I'll bury you! <laughs> I am tougher than I look, I promise. Reach belongs to the Force Lord. This really isn't working now, is it? Damn you! Well, you know what? I'm gaining a bit more control over that. Still a bit strange, however. many things that would come in handy for Madanak. That was... a bit more tiring than I expected. But I do feel better. 
which is probably not something that most people would say after turning into a hulking furry beast. It's a good, uh, takes care of tension a bit. Although I do sort of wish I hadn't turned back now. Now I wonder, of course, if I'm going to have to come back and reclaim some of these places for Matanak. Hopefully the answer is no. So now it's night time and foggy. Something tells me that the orcs will not be happy about me stopping in at a time like this. So... I'll just commandeer a bed for the night. Hopefully I don't wake up with a chicken sitting on me. <laughs> Interestingly enough. I've just had the urge to curl up in a nice... Cozy pile of fur. as the wolf. Would feel a bit safer, I'll be honest. It's not a very well defended place. was not exactly the most restful sleep I've ever had. Good enough. I don't like the idea of trying to navigate my way- Hello. Back. In the fog. Right, I came in from up there. But there were a few drops down, if I remember correctly. We're just going to go for it.
I quite like trying to navigate the reach. It's a challenge. One that I consider myself quite adept at undertaking most of the time. I remember this. Do not remember who that is. Not taking chances. Well, I did think these were a bit less bony. We must be getting close. I remember those saber cats. And frankly, I'm surprised that Vigilant didn't meet his end. To them, instead of me, at least. Where's the stronghold? And they have someone at one of the towers this time. Which probably means... I just called them at a strange hour before. Turned with the gauntlets. Enter. Speak to our chief right away. Were you the same one that was on guard last night? You must be, because the others wouldn't recognize me. Thank you very much, sir. These would make excellent staging grounds for... Clever. Seems there's much we could learn from our fellow pariah folk. Although the proper handling of animals might not be one of those things. Dog. Are you the chief? I don't believe it. You found the Forge Master's fingers. You've impressed me, Outlander. No one else has returned from this task before. By the code of Melikath, I name you Bloodkin to the Orcs. Let it be known among the strongholds that you are family now. I'm honored, Chief Lauric. Feel free to trade with our smiths for orc weapons and armor. 
trained with my warriors, or purchased poisons from the wise woman. Welcome to our stronghold, Bloodkin. I'll leave you to your... very public display of affection. Yes. Fight well. Well then. <laughs> Who are you? I envy you, Outlander. You can choose to leave if you wish. You want to leave? Yes. But I must stay here and wait for the day when I'll be married, and sent to another stronghold. It is our way, and I am proud to follow my people's traditions, but I can't help but feel chained. Hmm. What do you do for the stronghold besides... wait to be married and look terrifying in your armor? I am Lorik's daughter. Soon I'll be of age, and will be sent to marry an orc chief in some distant stronghold. Until then, I train. My new home will need strength, and my new sisters must know I am not weak when I arrive. So you don't know who you'll marry, then? No. A chief's daughter marries who her chief wishes. It ensures the stronghold receives a fair trade in goods for my absence. I used to look forward to the day when I was of age, to see new places and people. But now it feels like a cage. Interesting. It's good to meet you, Borgach. Fight well. You too. You seem to be... perfectly capable, frankly. <laughs> A bit frustrated. I don't think the... Boylan's folk have ever sent an emissary into a stronghold before. She might be useful as a guide. Hello? I work in the forge and the mines. Mother says it pleases her and our people. Right. Until next time. Gods, I don't even know who to talk to. is highly defensible. I should also probably return with proof that I've done this to Matanak, shouldn't I? Oh, I wonder what's up there. Excuse me. Need something? Ah, uh, No. No, I don't. Until next time. She's a bit terrifying. Intimidating. Oh, beautiful. suspect this is the mine. And a small shrine to Malakath. Who I'm sure would be...
intrigued by all of this. Now what are they mining here? Oh. Every orc learns the heavy labor of mining. All spend years in the caves. Can I... The mines are hard, but Malakath rewards those who rise to the challenge. Mm -hmm. What are you mining in here anyway? Oh. <coughs> this is indeed a... Looks like... That'll be Orichalcum. That reminds me of somewhere I saw that mine down in not quite Falgreath. And I've just thought of something else too. Do I dare take a companion along when I am what I am? I might as well give her a shot. Besides, she's interesting. <laughs> and far more intimidating than I am. Hello. Soon, I will be of age. The taste is bitter. Why don't you come with me instead? I couldn't. It would shame my chief, and my mother, and four Stupid mothers. Dog. Hmm. Well, this would be... A way to prove your strength, Stupid wouldn't dog. it? I'm not sure they'd understand, but... Stupid what do you know about my people, Outlander? Fair enough. Well, it was good to meet you anyway. Thank you for asking. Fight well. You... You too. <laughs> well, that shows me, doesn't it? dearest stronghold, at least, is allied with us. I'm probably going to have to go around to all of the other strongholds, aren't I? Not a not until after I report to Madanak and go around the Sabercats.